Judge Joe Brown. The defendant in this case acknowledges owing the plaintiff some money. He feels all bets are off because the plaintiff broke into his vehicle and stole $2,500. Let's see what the judge has to say. Credit card fraud, the amount in question, oh my goodness, fraud uh, attempted to be committed upon the state itself. Oh, that's three felonies I can think of. On top of one, you already had. Yo, and already Do a running from cheek. another one. Violation of probation. Do a I might cheek. bring that to the attention of some of the Davidson County Criminal Court judges when I see them at the upcoming judicial conference, which is to be held in Franklin, Tennessee. Do a background check. <laughs> <laughs> have all the details from his ID, name, address, and phone number. You might tender this to your local elected DA. Oh, I might even see that person. You know what? You're asking for some relief, but one of the things the law will not tolerate is somebody who comes in with unclean hands. That means that when that person has been doing wrong, don't expect a court to help you out when what you need help for is the direct consequences of your own wrongdoing. So you know what? You're out of here. Your complaint is denied. This courtroom is now in recess. I stole the money. What's left to say? Maybe the part about the plaintiff costing the defendant his original wheels? By the way, our cameras are real, and so is the ruling. Claim denied. Now we're on to the next case. Please raise your right.